Hello and welcome to another recording for my channel. Now I just did what I, uh, I'm just going to call an appendix video. Um, after the first one, to uh, I went through the Z, Z store and I just unlocked everything that I had. I just claimed everything that I've done throughout all the different games. So that's uh, about 20 minutes of me just going through all the Z, uh, Zen store and showing you all the uh, things that can be activated. There was a strange thing that the ships you can see here the ones that are lit up. They're the ones you can claim. And then the ones that are dark, uh, shadowed out, you can't claim them. But, there is it. Again, the Dyson, the Dyson ships. Yeah, well anyway, you can get the Dyson bundle, but you can't get the Dyson ship, which is Dyson <laughs> ships separately, which is uh, a little bit weird. So we'll talk to Wyoon. Um, I was going to do these ones for my second video, but um, they're not actually active. I can't actually do anything with them, too, uh, too much with them, because I don't think they'll activate until I've finished the um, story arc. And then um, that will open up the rest of this. So I can't do any of these uh, cube events because um, they're, not, they're all in the Alpha Quadrant. And I haven't got a fleet. I'm going to actually contact my um, Federation fleet, see if they're going to have a sister fleet for the Dominion. Okay, ready to head out. Okay, so let's continue this. Oh, it's not saying anything. Continue. Oh, Can I you forgot. vouch for the loyalty of your men? Then receive this reward from the founders. May it keep you strong. He's taller than all the other border, uh, border. Jem'Hadar, so obviously I chose the height, intimidating height thing correctly, but I think the body shape's a little off. Um, hopefully I won't start off in space and I can actually change my sh- uh, dang it. We're detecting a number of derelict vessels ahead on sensors. It looks like they ran afoul of some Hydran swarmers. How unfortunate. I believe this will be a teachable moment for our newly promoted first. Norris? I agree, of course. First, I'd like you to move ahead of the fleet and eliminate the swarmers. Take out the derelict vessels as well. They'll attract more vermin otherwise. It shall be done. Okay, so...
all our normal ships, now the military ships. So there are no normal one, two, three, or four ships. specific areas for those who ask. Ships, prepare for transit to the Alpha Quadrant. Is your vessel ready for the journey after your encounter with the Swarmers? Ready. As of this moment, we are all dead. We go into battle to reclaim our lives. This we do gladly, for we are Jimadar. Remember, victory is life. Victory is life. Gotta remember not to skip the video. I have a task I'd like you to handle first. Force down. There's a dead Kathy battle station in this sector. Heavily damaged and in danger of being destroyed in combat. I need you to extract a high value target on it before that happens. Think of a fear of mastery in this station. We'll then beat down the away team and escort said Kathy down. Thank you. 
idea what's going on. Let's just try to get to the station now without attacking anyone. Hopefully they won't draw, they won't draw a fire if we don't attack. No, awesome. We've entered transporter range to the station first. Is your away team ready? Beam over. Okay, so I'm going to, again, I'm going to have to go through all my um, crew and give them the uh, things I need, but for now we'll just go with what the standard basic startup is. Okay. I'm just wondering if we'll come across the Federation Klingon thing, because uh, they, in the storyline, we beamed over. Our senses have detected the Admiral. He is on the station's upper level, in the command area. I recommend haste. The Herc are likely to overrun the station, and soon. Find the Admiral and get him to safety. I'll update you once that happens. Acknowledged. Just bring this up a little. I hate when that happens. I think the game's crashed every single time. Okay, those can survive fire. Whatever those things are. Oh, the eyes! Yeah, they're so intense. He just got crushed between the two things. Hang out with the. Oh, okay. So Sweet, they got the um, subspace mines from uh, the Space Nine episode. War Front, I think. So many titles to remember. Okay, let's see. So this is basically the... Oh, it is. It's basically the same storyline from the last episode. Gotta try to remember the name of it in too. That's the case. We might not get the same episode. Um, Shadar. Shadar, here. If you come to help, you will be welcomed. If not, today is a good day to die for you. <laughs> Sorry, it just didn't sound very threatening. We're here for the Admiral. The Zen Kefi? Hm. He's caused enough trouble for one day. Take him away if you wish. Feel free to crush any herc you should find, too. There's plenty to go around. That didn't sound very Klingon. They should have wanted to fight to the death. Um, yes. Here they come. Oh, no, they've been beaten in the front. Okay, then. Why aren't I getting any targets? up here should avoid um, getting attacked by the bugs, whatever the hell they are. I'm sure they can jump up if they wish, but... We'll have to go 
all the way around? Yes, I do. I have to go back and all the way around. So, I'm gonna have to change my um, sprint button as well. That menu thing doesn't pop up. So, talk to the app. Jem'Hadar! Not the liberators I was expecting to be certain, but I will not refuse your aid. You are here to rescue me, yes? If not, I would like to die on my feet in combat. You will come with us. Very well. I have a war-capable shuttle on this station near the escape pods. I'll give you access to that section. Take me to it. Come along, no tricks. Why can't we just beam off? See, I'm just going to quickly change my sprint button. It's annoying the crap out of me. For some reason, Shift brings up a menu that is just got nothing to do with anything with the game. Maybe I'm sure it has something to do with something. Another thing. I'll show you the um level the... secure. We're needed elsewhere. Fight well. You've done well. My <laughs> shuttle is not so I can make it from here. My shuttle is just beyond this door. What is your saying? Ah yes. Victory is life. Okay. I'm confused as to whether- I see you've taken the Admiral out of harm's way. I expected nothing less from one of our finest. I have a new task for you first. Make your way to the torpedo bay and set one of the torpedoes there to detonate. That will take care of all the Herc on board quite nicely. It will be done. What's going on? Energy field thing. So, I'm gonna go back to the way I came, I think. Little white dots. Ah, oh, Federation. That's pretty cool. Ah, so you meet both of them and you can actually fight with both of them and then decide which one you want to join. Okay, makes sense. Jem Hadar, huh? This day just gets more and more interesting. If you're here for a fight, you'll get one. But with all this proto-matter around us, it might be brief. That was more threatening than the Klingon introduction, to be honest. We are not your enemies. Fantastic. If you're not here to fight, I'm gonna assume you're here to help. We were about to disarm all these beauties. I'm sure you noticed this place is a little unstable. No one's thrilled with the idea of all this proto matter exploding. Want to give us a hand? Okay. Um, I think the first part was better than the second part. I have orders to destroy the station. Right. And you figured a room full of proto matter would be the best way to make it go boom? <sighs> Wonderful. Look, let's compromise. We'll neutralize the proto matter in all but one of these torpedoes, which you'll set to detonate. Everyone's happy. My team needs three minutes to get it done. 
You okay with this plan? I will confirm. So, let's get to the plan. Ah, the renowned Starfleet efficiency. Three minutes is an acceptable time frame. Let the good commander know we are agreeable to his terms. And first, don't tarry once the demolition task is complete. We require your skills in combat over Bejour. Acknowledged. There's a whole heap of red dots. There was only one enemy. They all die straight away. I'm missing some. Oh, it's right there around the corner. One stack down. Keep up the good work. Okay, the little ones must have died straight away. Oh, this one must be a captain of some sort. It's taking a lot of... Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm so used to having the regenerative... Um, uh, tricorder regeneration from my Federation player. What's going on? Why can't I move? That weapon he's got is uh, extremely annoying. I just take a Kepha Cell White, which apparently. Oh. Another waste of Kepha Cell White. We're halfway done. Keep doing what you do best. Enemy targets on sensors. Flaking damage detected. I was saying, I couldn't even go. I couldn't actually uh, target anything. Fire. Okay, so the little ones die off so quickly, and then the, the boss battle is like uh, a long one. So, across the room again. Oh no, quickly. Darkened out, so it looks like I can't use it again. So left Enemy on yeah, this is the thing that killed me last time. Last one to kill. And now I can blow up the station. Not sure if that's because I killed enough or I've finished the level. So let's talk to him. We're good to go here. You want to push the big red button, or shall I? He seems like a smug prick. <laughs> he blew up us. Proto matter's done, but the explosives are still intact. Okay. It is my duty to begin the destruction. Okay, so does that mean I'm gonna get attacked once more, or is that it? All right. Proto matter nice is work. out of commission. It's been interesting fighting with Jem Hadar instead of the other way around. Well, command wants us somewhere else, so adios. Try not to get shot. Yeah. It left the well out there. Um, for him to say it's interesting to fight the Gem Hadar would be is interesting because uh, he doesn't look like he was in Starfleet 30 years ago, which is this storyline is based 30 years after the, the war. <laughs> Victory is life, Starfleet. Time is a factor here first. We have need of you back in space. Are you prepared to leave the station? Turn to ship. 
Ooh, he's already gone. Okay. I'm not sure if that was another storyline. It must have been part of the story arc, but I didn't activate a story. You've done well, First. I believe we are going to work together quite nicely. All for the glory of the Founders, of course. Our main task lies ahead. Simply put, we must save the Alliance forces in this sector from the Herc. I trust you're up for the challenge. The Herc will fall. Okay, now I got my butt kicked by them earlier, so hopefully... Um, I don't I was doing. They're much easier to get that way. Might have been part of the war thirty years ago. Mayday! Mayday! We're barely holding on here. Can anyone help? Target shield. Okay, I'm getting a lot of accolades. The Starfleet vessel <laughs> is in trouble. Target the herd forces and fire. Let's take the arrow and let's not fire anything else. Hopefully, we will. A lot of torpedoes on a little tiny ship. Okay, doing a lot more damage than we were earlier. But blowing up pretty quicker last time. Dominion vessel, thank you for your assistance. Rear shield failing. Whoa, 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 hey. We picked up an incoming Herc dreadnought. Stuck. A Herc force is coming your way. I will assist you. Oh, that sounds like uh, Tom Paris to me. This was good second. Why am I firing my torpedoes? a blast or something. For some reason I'm not firing for two days. Another well fought victory first. You continue to impress. I live to serve the Founders. And the Founders want you to serve alongside the Alliance as part of their defensive forces. There are two viable factions to consider Ooh. the Federation and the Klingon Empire. It's indulgent, I know, but I think the final choice should be yours. Who shall it be? Hmm. Oh. I didn't realize I'd be joining this fast. I thought I'd just finish the entire storyline before I did this. I'm gonna join the Klingons because Gem Hadara fighters and so are Klingons. And it just makes sense. About Starfleet. Explore, blah blah blah. Klingons defend. Okay, so I'm just gonna choose Klingons. If you wanna pause this and read that, go for it. But I'm just going to go for Klingons. It's a hail. Interesting choice. I think you'll fit in well there, eventually. It might take some time to get used to the way they operate, but I believe you're ready for the challenge. Just a moment found. What? Yes, found. Okay. This meeting is classified. Oh, my back. You are one of a special breed, chosen by the founders for great things. 
To that end, we will supply you with special gear and training. Awesome. Use this transponder to directly contact us on a secure channel. I expect regular reports, especially regarding unusual developments. And do remember, victory is life. Alrighty. Now, I don't remember how long this video has gone for so far. Demo recruit. Um. Damn it, I can't remember how long this video has gone. I should have, I forgot to check the um, time but when I started. Um. Wait for this to load. Actually, I might check it. I'm not sure if I can check it right now, but I'll give it a go. Uh, 31 minutes. Okay. I'll get that off the screen. I thought I was flying forward. Was, oh, a lot of accolades have popped up. Okay. Let's go. The Alliance has agreed to a summit meeting with us to discuss the return of the Herc and what can be done to prevent their aggression from devastating all four galactic quadrants. Despite recent events, they've agreed to host the summit at Deep Space Nine. I'm not surprised. None of the galactic powers are comfortable hosting a Dominion fleet deep within their territory. Meet with me at DS9 prior to the beginning of the summit. I'd like to discuss our options. Ah, so Ketracel White is a major um, thing for the Gem Hadar. Let's see. Do I... If it's not part of a kit, I don't really care which one I get. I if you'll excuse me. Storm clouds gather. Ah, oh, that's the exit. Go to DS9 as soon as you can. I don't have anything for you at the moment. No, I don't want to start the next story. I want to just go to the the ship part and um, oh, wait a minute. Let's have a look at the galactic map. Whoa, that is quite a large chunk. I didn't. I did not expect it to be that big. Okay. This is quite a large expansion into the game because if you look at that, you know that's uh, that's a little bit smaller than this, and that's um, a little over half the size of that. That's quite a large expansion, and considering that they didn't explore too much of uh, the Gamma Quadrant because of the uh, war, that is something we're going to have to go in depth in the video and just check out all the sectors. Okay, so let's approach just Deep Space Nine for now. I just want to check my ship, uh, change my ship to the uh, the Vanguard battle. I think it was battle cruiser. It was one of the more advanced ships. It just had better. Um, okay, obviously there are a lot of Dominion players. <laughs> so a lot of the people are playing the new Dominion because you can just see all the uh, Dominion ships. And there's a few Federation ships here, so not everyone is doing it. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna dock. See what happens. Nothing. Okay. And maybe you come out of the. Uh, oh! They've upgraded Deep Space Nine as well. The interior and exterior of Deep Space Nine has been upgraded. So we're gonna have to do a tier, uh, tour of the station. But I'm gonna save that for the next video. I'm just gonna quickly run to the shipyard and change my ship. And then after that, we'll do a tour of Deep Space Nine. Come on. The faster you load, the faster the video goes. Whoa, what? <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, okay. Okay. So you do, you exit. That is uh, awesome. They have added so much option to the uh, game. I'm just wondering if the... Um, What's this? Customize. Acquire ships. So that would mean... Uh, 
But they've added all these little shops on the outside as well, because there weren't that many. Okay. I think that means that the Gem Hadar have their own little section. Is that it? The Gem Hadar have their own little sh <laughs> station. Ah. We're going to have to do an in-depth exploration of... Um, I don't want to acquire a ship, I want to swap the ship. What's this? Repair ship? What's this? Talk to ship. Where is the ship swapping? Oh, right there. Nope. I can't. Let's have a look at this. I've done another. Okay, so I've done the three. Okay. Ah, oh, okay, so can I... Ah, yep, there you go. So since I chose a side, I can now do all the quests. So that's something we're going to have to go into, which means I should have access to all the Klingon ships. Yep, okay. Um, I'm going to save this for the next video, but I'm going to go through, and I am going to buy every single ship, have a, uh, access to all of them. Okay, all ranks. Third, second, first. Four. Okay, so that's the ensign level. Fourth. Third. Second. First. Okay, okay, awesome. Um, but what I wanted to do is acquire, not acquire, uh, to change the ship I'm using. How do I do that? Okay, all these rooms have glowing green console. Oh, this is going to drive me insane. Where is... That's the temple. That's medical, I think. That's got to be where the ship's... on security officer. Oh, 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 it's over there. Let's have a run over here. It was back. Ah, it's the security office. Okay, so Odo's back in his security office. Did they completely remove the... Um... Okay, I'm going to stop the video here because I'm running around everywhere. So I'm just going to go back to the... Shipyard place. Okay. I'll go here. We'll start the tour from this room and then we'll just go around the entire station because that's basically directly halfway. And we'll just go around and we'll check all the different rooms and all the consoles and everything. That's. That's got to be Quark's bar because it's in the middle. It's a big room. That's too small to be his bar, so that's got to be the bar. Okay, we'll stop the video here. Um, we will uh, do a tour of the station. Okay, thank you. If you want to pause and read this, that's fine, but you'll get this if you play the game, so I don't really see the point. Uh, so we'll just delete that. Um, I will show you the, the um, inventory. So everything up to here... I got from going through my Z store and just activating all of the um, available things I had. A lot of these ships doubled up because I went through uh, discount packs which had ships and the level 6 which had the same thing so I just activated them without actually reading them so I've got two of everything basically but I've activated all the ships I've got um, uh, yeah, all those ships. Uh, again, we'll go through this these now that they're active. I will have to get onto my Federation um, character and see if they've created a sister fleet for the character for anyone who wants to join that. To cut. Oh, is that a character? That's a character. Okay. Um, call themselves a cut. Okay. 
We'll just okay. I'm I'm, I'm babbling. I'm, I'm I'm giddy with excitement. So I'm just gabbling. Yeah, no doubt. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so we'll end the video now, um, and we'll come back and we'll do a video tour of the station with all the new uh, interior designs. Uh, if you have any comments to help help the uh, channel grow, have any comments for uh, character playthrough, um, please leave them down below. All I ask is that you keep the conversation civil, and I'll see you in the next video. Okay.